spiritual blessings. This last week, Chelsea Kim, I found out that Chelsea, who's one of our preteens, she is, um, she is moving to Canada. In fact, she left yesterday. And I hated to hear that because Chelsea Kim is such a sweet girl and she is a very gifted violinist. When she came to our church, she came not knowing Christ, but very gifted as a musician. She got involved in our orchestra ministry and got involved in our preteen ministry. And long story short, she came to faith in Christ. And when she came to faith in Christ, the puzzle pieces started coming together for her. She wrote me a letter about three months ago. And she basically said this. I'm so thankful for this church because they have taught me about God. Before now, I didn't know why I was here. I didn't have purpose. I didn't have meaning. Sixth grader writing this. But God has taught me that my life has a reason. And that he loved me enough to die on the cross. And she just went on and on about thank the Broadmoor family. She wrote Dr. Bug before she left. Duran wrote him before she left and said some of the same things. And when I thought about it this week, I thought, you know, that's why we're building it. For Chelsea Kim. Because now she'll go, she's going to Canada to stun a study under an internationally renowned uh, violin instructor. And, and she may be back, but she may never be back. But here's what I know, that at this time, at this place, because of you, these people, because of our collective effort to go the distance, that God has changed her eternity and he has changed her perspective for a lifetime. And most of all, she said, I know that this gift that God has given me to play the violin, it's not for me. It is to glorify Him. And so I asked her if she would be willing to play a song for us. And she, she did. It's on, it's on video because she's in Canada today. But, but I want you to listen to those beautiful tunes that she played. Because as you look into her eyes, her face... We built it for her. We'll build it for her and for people like her. People like Shoeless Joe who come thinking they've been disqualified. But we will only do it if we listen to the words of what she plays. Turn your eyes on Jesus. And our sacrifice becomes an incredible opportunity to worship Him. Let's watch it together and we'll close our service.
Let's pray. God, thank you for Chelsea, for what you have placed in her hand has been completely redefined. Not just a talent, but it is a gift that you have given her to glorify you. And Lord, every one of us in this room, you have given us gifts. If we will exercise our faith, we will see you work. Least of which is in our finances. But God, we pray that in this time, that you would help us have a heart like you had. That on the cross, you saw Chelsea, you saw us, and you were willing to go the distance. Incredible act of sacrifice. And now you invite us to discover that that it is the pathway just as you experienced a blessing. It's a pathway to blessing for us. Help us to be faithful. We turn our eyes on you. But we thankful, we're thankful that as we look into your eyes, we also see the faces of people who will be impacted because of what you did and what you want to do through us. We give you this time. In Jesus' name, amen.